Aquarius, I am sorry it cut off. I don't know if my phone is dying. No, it's not. So, I don't know what you guys lost, but there's a situation here, Aquarius, where somebody is either chasing you or and you're running from this person. You're running from this person. You're determined to get away. You're determined to have a rebirth, a new beginning with a love union. But you could have been generous to somebody that don't want to, that wants you. I don't know. It could be same sex who's chasing you and you're running from it. You don't want you don't want it. You want your this union, this rebirth with this other person. This could be somebody in your past that broke your heart that's trying to chase you. Yeah, you opened up to this person. You gave this person some type of open opening where either you helped them or you started. Maybe you weren't communicating with this person. You started back communicating with this person. And now they just won't leave you alone. And you're tied to somebody else. You're in a love union. And you're trying to... There's solitude here. You could be trying to stay away from the person, but it could be hard. They're not leaving you alone. But your person, no. Your person is an alchemist and very intuitive, unknowable. They know everything. They see everything all around them. They see it. You can't hide it. Somebody know that they're, they're being heartbroken or somebody's about to get their heart broke. You could be trying to prevent from breaking your person's heart. Change is here. There's change here. Some upheaval. Change is upheaval. Change is new beginnings, rebirth. Okay, something's going to change. I don't know. Spontaneity. You could have went did something with this person from your past. And somebody could have got pregnant. This is rebirth. Spontaneity. Something happened fast, quick, in a hurry. I don't know. It might not be no spontaneity in your relationship. And maybe this is why you fell for this person. I don't know if you did do something with, with this person. Maybe y'all was on some type of trip together. Because rest is here. Some type of vacation. and Something happened. Be careful. Or I don't know. Respect is here. Or this person is going to try to do this to you. Bitch, pregnant by you. When you're relaxing, chilling, or something like that. They may know you have a lot of respect for your partner. If they know that you have a partner. And they're going to try to load it on you, honey. They're going to try to just load it on you. Or you could be feeling burdened about a situation. You could have already did this and you're feeling burdened about it. But you need to be honest. You need to be honest to your partner, yourself. Joy is here. You need to be honest and illuminate the truth to your to this other person. If you didn't do this and this or this is what this person is trying to plan to do to you, get pregnant by you, there could be a hidden pregnancy for somebody out there, Aquarius. And the, and your the partner need to be truthful who did it. Okay, um, but truth needs to be illuminated. Okay, if you want any type of happiness. You know somebody chasing you and you trying to run from this person. You need to tell that person that's chasing you the truth. That you're in a love union. You want to be with your partner. Leave you alone. Or you need to tell your partner as well. What's going on? If you got somebody chasing you, you can't get rid of them. So they know what's going on. Okay? You need to wake this person up. If this person is same sex, leave me alone. No, you're not like that. I don't do that. Leave me alone. I'm in a love union with somebody I want to be with. And I don't want to mess it up. You could be feeling insecure or something. Karma is here. If, if you go forward with this, there's karma to pay for this. Repression is here. Because you're hiding. You're hiding the truth. Somebody's hiding the truth. Somebody feels like exploding. It's like, or you building a wall up is making you dark inside or something. Passion is here. So maybe you did have a one night stand, a passionate one night stand with this person and you're hiding it. You're building a wall up. You're, you could be building a wall up with your partner. Due to this, 
Roots is here. I don't know. Did somebody have... Is this a family member? Roots is here. Somebody could have put roots on somebody. So this person could have put roots on you. Somebody could be dealing with roots. Put roots on you. To hold on to you like a soul tie. And it's hard for you to break free from this person. Or lineage. Something's from lineage. Or you have family ties. I don't know if somebody did something with family. Like an incest type thing maybe. And they're hiding it. I don't know. Ooh, I hope that's not what this is. Passion and roots. And it's hidden, but it's from lineage. Maybe it's in the family line. I, that came in the, the other. Voyager is here. Voyager. This something's in the dark. Voyager. Movement. Balance. Voyager. This is from way back. Something. Maybe it was in family line. If this is something incest going on with somebody in the family, maybe you're trying to run. Maybe it's somebody in your family. You got your family ties with somebody. Cousin. There's some passion you have for a family member. And it's been going on for a long time. A lineage thing. It's in family ties. Some family got passion for each other. Let me do. I'm going to do a few more cards. That's for somebody. Inspiration is here inspiration is here like you could break away you gotta pray you could break away dance dance is here you may be trying to dance your way around something or around this person you could try to dance your way around somebody or there's a lot of passion you have for somebody. Or somebody got a lot of passion for you in the family. Like this could be somebody that's involved in incest. Like somebody's wrapped up in a shell. Like. Flow. I don't know. Okay, so I'm going to stop right there. <sighs> I don't know. That is something. Something deep. Something's heartbreaking. There, something maybe is going to come out to be heartbreaking to somebody. But somebody's trying to get away from something. And it, it could be causing them grief. Or the other person grief. Could, that the person is running from them. It's something. Somebody running from something. And it's causing somebody that's a lot of grief. But you got to face it. Be truthful. Tell the truth. Quit hiding. Quit, quit building up a wall. Tell the truth. Okay, Holy Spirit. Aquarius. So what else do you have for Aquarius? Aquarius, what else? What other advice do you have for Aquarius? Holy Spirit. Aquarius. 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 Holy Spirit. Okay. Phoenix. How's that for a happily ever after? How's that? Okay, so you might be you might come you might be coming off in a victory in a situation. You could have been going through some obstacles, but you made it through, okay? Because it says, How's that for a happily ever after? Okay, and you're holding your hands up. You're giving it to God. You're giving it up to God, and you're getting a victory due to that. Okay, some some type of obstacle, you, you made it through, or you're making it through because you gave it up to God. Mirror, treat your body like the palace it is. Love yourself, okay? Treat your body like the palace it is, okay? If nobody else can respect it, you respect it, okay?
When somebody not respecting you, don't give them your body. Some of you may need to make somebody use protection because they could be reckless out there. Okay, somebody could be very, very reckless and you need to know your worth and protect you. Okay. Feast. Slow down and celebrate yourself. Okay, slow down, Aquarius. Celebrate yourself. Love yourself. Treat yourself. Nurture yourself, sweetie. You may not feel like cleaning up. That's okay. Because we all go through that. Because look at this female. She's around stuff that's on the floor. She's treating herself. She's worried about her. She's not worried about nothing else around her. Okay? She's all about her right now. So that's how you may need to be right now. Be all about you. Treat you. Nurture you. Now, if nobody else ain't going to love you, you need to love you. You need to treat you like you the queen, king of the palace. If nobody else ain't going to do it, you sit on your throne. Protest. Start a revolution. Yeah, there's a situation you might need to start protesting it in. You might need to protest to be heard. Somebody may not be hearing you. Somebody may not be understanding you. So you might need to bro protest. Do a strike. Not give you. Not give all of you. If they can't give all of them, don't give them all of you. If somebody sit there and tell you they can't give you what you, if you know you should have or be given, don't give it to them. Protest. Strike. Start a revolution. Lock them out. Like they locking you out. Because if somebody sit there and tell you they can't give you or love you like you want to be loved? What's that telling you? You're not willing to. So you don't give them, don't give them all of you. Tower. Somebody could be going through a tower. Somebody, you could be going through a tower. Like this could be anything. A loss of a job. Somebody around you could have lost a job or going through some type of ending. Or you may be shocked. Something may shock you. Okay. Where it is to the point where you need to relax, let go, meditate, pray for a little while. You may need to take time off to yourself, okay? If you're going through some type of tower, unplug. If you lost a job, just relax, get away, you know? Allow it to happen. Some things you can't control, let go, okay? Let it go. Some things you can't control. You can't control other people. You can't control things that happen in your life. Not everything. You can't control it. So relax. Exercise. Go to the gym. Do something nurturing for yourself. Okay? To make you feel good. Because you may be feeling upside down right now. This, <laughs> this tower, if you haven't gone through it yet, this tower you might be about to go through, you might be feeling upside down right now. So you're going to need to let go, relax, just allow it to happen, go with the flow. Bitch fire. But there's a situation you, you darn need to stand up for yourself, stand your ground in. Because somebody could be being a, being a pure T bitch to you. Well, you're going to have to defend yourself and stand your ground. And you're going to need to be a bitch too. But we could all be bitches in a professional way, okay? You don't have to be unprofessional. You don't have to be ghetto. All right? Stand your ground. Light your fire, honey. Fight back. Okay? Fight back. Because somebody could be taking you for granted. Because they think you're weak. And you need to start showing them you're not weak. Okay? That you do have the power. You do have control of you. But sometimes we let love make us look weak. Or somebody feel like because you love them so much. That you're weak. And they start disrespecting you. Treating you any kind of way. All right, so you need to give a little back. Show them, show them you're not weak. Okay, they're the weak one. Witch, justice is coming. Somebody could be dealing with a witch, <laughs> but you got justice coming. Okay, somebody could be going around saying you're a witch, but you got justice coming. You getting the victory. Okay, you getting the victory in this situation. Mural is here. Be your own first priority. Put yourself first, okay? Put yourself first. 
stop putting stop putting somebody first that don't give a crap about you. The selfish. Put you first. Start putting you first. Love yourself. Love yourself, of course. Okay. If they're not giving what you give, yeah, don't worry about it. Don't give them jack. Give what they give you. Okay? Okay, so we're going to get into your reading, Aquarius. We're going to see what's going on. Okay, Holy Spirit. Aquarius. Aquarius, what's going on? Okay, so um, water sign. You could be dealing with a water sign. Somebody sees you as a wish fulfillment. Somebody not letting you go. Somebody's holding on to you. But somebody dealing with a lot of other options, but they want to hold on to you because they know you're the one. You're the, you fulfill them in every area. You fulfill them in every area where they're getting fulfilled from, from these other people. Like, these other people can only fulfill them in one cup. Well, you fill them in all the cups. But they still deal with these other options. If they hold on to you because you're fruitful. And everything else. Somebody greedy. Okay, so we have the um, Ace of Cups here. Yeah, somebody could be being fulfilled with somebody they're having a new start in love with, but they hold on to you. Or somebody could be wanting a new start in love with you, knowing darn well they're still dealing with all these other options. Three of Swords is here. Somebody's dealing with a third party. This person could have um, broke your heart, dealing with third parties. Holy Spirit. Pisces, Scorpio, Cancer is here. Or this is somebody who's coming around wanting a new start in love with you. And this is, they broke your heart in the past. This. Um, Ace of Swords is here. Clarity is here. This person could have got some type of clarity that you're on a successful new beginning somewhere else with someone else. <laughs> oh my god this could be somebody at a distance from you holy spirit aquarius six of wands here they rushing in to get a victory with you this person like they may they may come in they may try to tempt you sexually there's some type of public announcement they're gonna come rush in and tell you it's gonna be passionate it's going to be a lot of passion behind it, okay? They're going to do this to get a victory with you. But, okay, the fool is here. Yeah, they're coming in for another chance. Sag Leo Aries energy. This could be you with water in your chart. You could have Pisces, Scorpio, Cancer in your chart. This person could have broke your heart, dealt with a third party, could have left you for a third party. Now here they come. Rushing back in because they got clarity that you're having a successful new beginning with someone else. Yeah, they coming, honey. They rushing in with all this passionate, emotional conversation. Deep. It's going to be deep, honey. And this is all in order to, to get another chance with you, to get you to take a risk on them again. Don't trip. Don't trip. Don't fall off that ledge, Aquarius. Okay, Holy Spirit. Aquarius. This could be an Aries. It's a fire sign. Uh-huh, two of pentacles. They're going to have you juggling with a decision between your person and them. This is what they want, okay? They want you to juggle. Or this person is willing to be in a juggling situation with you. Like, they're going to come in offering you sex just to get what, what, what they want. Holy Spirit. And they're hoping you fall for it. Holy Spirit. Let's see. The moon card. Mm -hmm. They're coming in deceptive. Okay? So, whatever they have to say is deceptive. Okay? And you may even hide it from your partner. You may hide this from your partner. 
And you may just juggle your partner over this person. Oh, my God. Yeah, communication is here. Yeah, this person, whatever they say to you, it's a lie. Everything they say to you to get another chance with you is a lie. Okay? It's okay to forgive them. Okay? It's okay to forgive this person, all right? But that's all I would do is forgive them. Because they're coming in deceptive. They're lying. Whatever they say to you, communicate to you, it's all a lie. It's to get you to trip. It's to get you to take this risk with them. Okay, they're going to come in offering. <clears throat> and they think ain't going to be wet and squirting or whatever. I don't know. Maybe this person a squirt. Or maybe when y'all used to have sex in the past, they'd squirt or something like that. <laughs> they're going to tip you with it. Oh, they're going to tell you this. Oh, it's wet. It's juicy, honey. And they're going to tempt you. They're going to tempt you with that coochie, honey. Mm-hmm. With that wet, wet. Or when you used to deal with them, maybe they used to be real, real wet or something. And they know it. They know they can tempt you because, I don't know, maybe this person used to be real, real wet and be a squirter. <laughs> I don't know. But they are just coming in with some strong, passionate communication to get you to take a risk with them. Yep, Seven of Swords is here. Yeah, whatever they say to you, communicate to you, it's a lie. They're coming to steal from you. I don't know if it's money. They're, they're lying. They're deceiving you. They're doing this to get you to cheat on your partner. This is what they're doing. Okay, so let's see. Let's, oh my God. Aquarius, if you do this, you's a fool. The fool card is here. This person gonna make a fool of you, honey. Mm -mm. They're trying to get you to juggle your partner. And they're, they're deceived. Oh my God. Ten of Wands is here. All this person can do to for you is cause burdens in your life. Okay? This person was somebody that was a burden in the past. You couldn't trust them. They cheated on you. They lied. They could have stole money from you. And, and remember why you released them. Because this is why you released this person. Holy Spirit. Because they caused you a lot of burdens. You're going to have to remember that, Aquarius. Holy Spirit, Aquarius. The Ten of Pentacles. Okay, so this is somebody you have something long term with. Somebody could have some close ties to your family and they may use that as well to get what they want from you to get you to take this risk with them. Ten of Pentacles is here. Or you could already be in a long term situation. And all they're going to do is cause burdens with that long-term situation you're already in. Page of Pentacles is here, Aquarius. There's a new beginning of growth here. This person may tell you they want a new beginning of growth with you, but they're lying. They're being deceptive. They could be looking for money. Maybe they feel like you have a lot of money. There could be an inheritance involved. Don't fall for it. Seven of Wands. Spirit is telling you right here, you need to block this person. You need to fend this person off. Holy Spirit. You, Spirit is saying you need to block communication. It's right up under strength. You need to be strong. You're going to need to use your strengths with this person. Because <laughs> this may be a type of person don't give up. We're going to see if Emperor pop out. Wands is here because they're going to fight for it. They're coming in to cause conflict and confusion. This is what they're coming to do. They're coming in to cause a lot of conflict and confusion. Spirit is telling you to block this person. Temperance is here. Protection. This is spirit.
Okay, so spirit could be blocking this person from you. Because there's protection here. Temperance is here. Or if you do sleep with this person, you better wear some protection. Um, This person may try to get you to drink. If you go out with this person anywhere or take this person up on their offer, you better protect yourself. This person may try to get you drunk to get to play with your emotions. The Knight of Cups is here. Yeah, they're going to offer you something to drink. They're going to try to get you drunk. And then they're going to try to have sex with you. Here you go. All these cards offer. Look at this. Spirit is saying you need to reject this offer because they're going to try to they may try to put something in your drink or get you, either get you drunk, offer you something to drink to, to uh, make it easier for them to um, do whatever they plan on doing with you. Holy Spirit, Aquarius. Yep. You ain't going to be able to sleep or this person can't sleep worrying maybe if it's gonna work or not or you you could have blocked them i don't know the sun card hmm i'm trying to see something they're trying to give you something to keep you up at night so you can't sleep The sun card. Because there's something that's... Um, the sun card is here. I don't know if it's concerning a child. Or it's something that's going to be illuminated to you. Somebody's on a horse, on the water, on a beach. I don't know. I don't know. Is this a family? Because it's under Ten of Pentacles. Like a family gathering. And then up under it's Nine of Cups. Somebody going to offer somebody something. Spirit is saying you need to reject this because something going on. If something's going to have you up. You're not going to be able to. You're going to be worried about something. Or you're worried about this. You're worried about it's going to be illuminated. Holy Spirit. Or this could have already happened. I don't know. This looks like a trip, a beach. You sitting on the beach and this person offers you something. Or maybe they offered you a trip or offered you to go on a trip or something. You straddling the fence. Four of swords. So, I don't know. Is this you worrying that something's going to be illuminated concerning healing with something with this person? Maybe they offer a healing with you. Or because... Be careful. Because something may make somebody sick. Because it's right up under temperance where somebody's pouring in a cup. Somebody may drink something and it's going to make somebody sick. Then I got this before in Aquarius. Somebody is going to get sick. But somebody, is, or they're going to try to make you sick, but it, temperance is protection. So you're going to heal. Somebody could have did something trying to stress you out. I don't know. Put something in your drink. I don't know. Something's going to be illuminated. Yeah, four pinnacles. And this is so you could they could you could be dependent on them. Somebody offered you something, so you could be dependent on them. Maybe to make you stay in the bed. But spirit protected you. Cause I don't know if it was supposed to make you sick or sleep a lot. <laughs> yeah, because the star card is here. You healed. 
You heal. If you going on a trip, <clears throat> hmm, or did they do this to keep you from going on a trip? The star card is here, but you heal. You heal successfully. Because um, the offer is somebody rejecting it. You rejected, you rejected the drink or something like that. Or spirit is saying you need to reject the drink. Page of Cups is here. There you go again. Pour it out. Like your intuition is telling you to pour it out. Spirit is telling you to pour it out. Because look at their tip in the cut. Pour it out. Like you can't sleep at night. Spirit may be jugging you, jugging you, telling you, pour it out. Do not drink that. Something's in that drink. Pour it out. Pour it out. Do not drink it. It's fish. Something got something to do with fish. Or maybe it's something they're going to do to try to get pregnant by you, have a child with you. Because it's fish pouring out of the cup. Holy Spirit. Aquarius. Oh, this is crazy, Aquarius. The Five of Swords is here. You need to pray. Pray the Spirit. To fight this person off, you need to pray the Spirit. Because it's got something, yeah, this is being illuminated to you. Spirit is trying to illuminate to you to show you. I don't know, this may be on the beach because there's a lot of water pictures. Five of Swords. Competition is here. Defeat is here. This person may not be the type to be defeated. Or they're going to be mad because Spirit illuminated this to you. Or because you rejected it, you poured it out. Or it's not going to work. I got to do another reading, y'all. This is crazy. This is a good reading. And then I'm going to bed. I gotta do one more for y'all. Um, I'm gonna do one more and then I'm getting off of here. This is part two. Okay, this one because the other one cut off. And then I gotta go lay down, y'all. What time is it? Okay, Holy Spirit, show Aquarius what else they need to know. What's going on? I'm gonna see what comes out. Aquarius, because that one was crazy. Aquarius. Okay, so Six of Swords is here. Moving on, balance, moving to better waters. Um, yeah, you're going to be moving to better waters. You're going to be moving on in a situation where you're protected. It's protected. Spirit is saying you can move forward. You're protected. Okay, a King of Cups is going to try to offer you something. Okay? Um, they're going to do something sneaky. Maybe to keep you from moving on, but you're protected. All right? That's a cancer energy. Because you're going to be getting some type of offer from a king of cups. All right. Um, Holy, Holy Spirit. Holy Spirit. Aquarius. I'm feeling sick on the stomach now. Oh, Lord. Page of Wands is here. Yeah, they're going to come in being nice, kind, friendly. Or they're going to offer... You could be having a lot on your plate. And they're going to may offer you something. Some type of money to help. To, to Like they want to help you be stable. Okay? Or this is spirit. 
guiding this person to give you this offer to help you um, because you have a lot on your plate, all right? There's some type of communication that's going to come in to this person or to you. But Queen of Pentacles, it's, it's something that's going to put you in a stable energy. The star, so you can move forward successfully. The star card, Aquarius energy. Holy Spirit. Yeah, something's going to be offered to you so you can move forward successfully. Holy Spirit, let's see. Holy Spirit, Aquarius. Because the star card came out. You could be moving the metal waters with Aquarius. With another Aquarius. This is spiritually led. Four of Cups is here. So there's an offer coming in, but I don't know. You might need to hold back from accepting an offer or reject the offer. Oh my God. Let's see, because the star card here, you're healed, or you're healing, or they're hoping and praying that they can heal things with you with this offer. They could have offered to you and then held back from giving you this offer, or you rejecting the offer, or it's not going to work. It's not going to work because you're protected. Holy Spirit. Aquarius. See, this is somebody giving somebody something. The other one was saying that as well. The Emperor. Somebody somebody may not have good intentions. Because look at this Emperor. They look all evil and mean. This could be somebody's husband or wife doing this, giving this offer. And you may reject the offer and they may get pissed about it. But they're doing it for greedy, selfish reasons. This is why they're giving you this offer. They, this offer has no good intentions. Okay, this person is going against the grain. This is somebody they're holding the world in their hand. Like they feel like they control everything, that they have the power. They're holding this ball in their hand. Like they have all the power. Like they have the power. They have the control. Things are going to go their way. They feel like they have all this power that they can make things go their way. They're mad. Maybe you reject this offer. You rejected this offer and they're pissed off about it. Now they're, they're going against the grain. Okay? They're, they're doing something sneaky. Something clever. Ace of Swords. They got some type of clarity. This is why they're doing this. That you're moving forward in a successful new beginning. Okay? Eight of Wands. And it's you're moving forward fast and abundant. They got some type of news that came in, honey. That you're going to be abundant. Or that you're moving forward in abundance. Fast, quick, in a hurry, in your stability. Six of Cups is here. Or you're going to get some type of clarity that they're moving forward in a successful new beginning with somebody. Or they're moving away with somebody in the past. Six of Cups is here. Or this, they're hearing this about you moving forward. They feel like you're moving forward too fast. So they're going to come in and, and give you something. Six of Cups. Yeah, they may feel like you're moving forward with a soulmate. Or this is them. All they can think about is the past between you and them. And they're hoping and praying that they can heal things with you. Holy Spirit, let's see. This could even be a father figure. This could even be a father figure, an emperor. Could be controlling somebody's successful new beginning. Feel like somebody's moving too fast. I don't know. Um, Ten of Cups is here. Some of you may be finding out, getting clear that somebody's moving forward with somebody in their past that they dealt with, a soulmate in their past, like a family, somebody that 
they had a family within the past and maybe the father a father figure could be controlling this like i don't know maybe you may be wanting to heal things with somebody or somebody's healing something with somebody there was an offer somebody gave to somebody somebody could have rejected this person's offer and a father stepped in to control it in order to move this person forward in a successful new beginning like this emperor has some communications with somebody concerning moving forward in a successful new beginning with somebody in the past like maybe going back to a family a ten of cups maybe something was offered to this person eight of wands holy spirit uh-oh but somebody may have a lot on king of cups is here under the emperor cancer energy this is a father figure you could have gave somebody some type of advice or offer some help due to them having a lot on their plate they could have offered stability to this person to help them pay their bills or something so some aquarius somebody may be moving to better waters but you are protected you're going to be okay you're going to be protected you're still going to be balanced somebody could have turned their back on the offer because the page of wands the son this could be the son of the person because this is the king cups is the father the page of wands is the son and their back is turned to the father the father is handing the cup but the sun is not looking at the cup. They're looking at the queen of pentacles. Like they see this queen of pentacles as being very nurturing, kind, loving, supportive. So maybe they're choosing to have an equal give and take with this queen of pentacles, which is you. And they did not accept the offer because they find you to be healing. So they rejected this king of cups offer. And this emperor, oh my God, this king of cups is mad about it. But spirit, temperance is spirit protecting maybe your union with this person, protecting you. Yes, this person, this emperor is mad like because this person did not accept this offer. This page of wands gave them clarity that they want a successful new beginning with you. There was a lot of communication between this emperor and this um, page of wands. Because somebody wanted somebody to go back to their past where they had a ten of cups a family or they could even offer them a ten of cups they could offer them a new house a new car or anything if they go back to their past a soulmate from their past holy spirit aquarius aquarius page of swords is here somebody got mad because they offer was rejected there could be a lot of gossip somebody could have said some bad things concerning you or the union between you and this person because it was bad or this your person defended you the the page of swore is the sun they defended you the page of wands the page of swore the moon is here but they'll never tell you this this is going to be kept hidden the moon card is here something could have been deceptive about the offer deep holy spirit aquarius
the page of cups so you will never know about this offer that was offered to them page of cups they're this person is feeling like they're being spiritually led to be with you to offer to you or like you're fulfilling to this person like they feel like they have their their um divine partner their fulfillment holy spirit let's see i don't know let's see five of swords is here Okay, so I'm picking up intimidation. Like, they didn't let this person intimidate them. Like, they defended you. They stood their ground. But it's going to be hidden. And this is going to be kept a secret. Five of Swords. There was an argument and they defeated. They defeated the person that was offering okay they they defeated this person okay because they feel like they have a strong spiritual connection with you they they yeah the high priestess and your intuition i don't know your intuition could have already known this Holy Spirit. See, this person is following spirit. They're following spirit. They're doing what spirit. They feel like spirit wants them to go. The way spirit wants them to go. Not the way that, you know, this person is not letting whatever was offered to them control them. Or not let whatever was offered to them make their decision. They're doing what they feel spirit wanting them to do. Strength is here. Yeah, this person is a strong person you deal with. It was some strong, heavy communication. They stood their ground. Strength card. Because it was an argument. Like, they really defended you. I don't know. It was some bad things may have been said. Some gossip. Oh, Lord. Communication is here. Um... I don't know. Somebody could have apologized for it. For what they said. For the argument. I mean, the, the father could have apologized. Whoever the person was with the offer. They got mad. Somebody don't give up. Somebody don't go against the grain. Somebody don't like to lose. Two of swords is here. But you'll never know this. Your intuition, yeah. But you're never going to know this. This person will never tell you this. It's going to continue to be hidden from you. That they chose you over this offer. You'll never know they was offered to go back to their past. You will never know that, Aquarius. You you know, but you're not going to know like proof, no. You're not going to know by proof. You're going to know by spirit. But you're not going to know by proof, like physical proof. Like this person actually coming out and telling you this. Seven of Cups is here. Yeah, you're not going to know that they was offered the world. Like, they were offered all these things to go back to their past. Or something like that. If it's not go back to their past, I don't know. It's somebody. Pisces, Scorpio, Cancer, somebody, a soulmate. This could be family. I don't know. It's it's something in the past they were offered. And it was a lot of conversation about them going back to, to their past, having a family with their past. But they fought against it. Holy Spirit. And I'm about to give up on this. Holy Spirit. Aquarius. Wow.
But somebody don't like to lose. The lovers. Somebody's in love with you, Aquarius. They feel like the spirit meant for you and them to be together. That spirit dropped you in their life. And this is why they fought hard. Okay? They're in love with you. Page of Pentacles. And they want this new beginning to grow. They, There may not be much here. You, you may not have much, but they want this new beginning to grow with you. Because they're in love with you. They feel like spirit put you in their life. And this union is protected. It is protected. The tower is here. Yeah. I don't know. God, Lee. String card. God, Lee, there's a lot of people. Communicate. Yeah, this communicate. You'll never know this communication was on them ending it with you, the tower. You'll be shocked if you found out. You're going to be so shocked. If you do find out, you're going to be shocked. But they fought... They defended you. Know that this person defended you, okay? It pissed them off. They was mad about it. Whatever was said, they was mad. They didn't trust the offer. They felt like the offer was deceptive. Holy Spirit. But you will never know. They'll never, they'll never tell you, Aquarius. Yeah, this person's in love with you. They rejected the offer because they was in love with you, Aquarius, but they would never tell you. You would never know this. They're in love with you. They see you as, like, the world. Like, they know they can have abundance with you. They can have prosperity with you. They really want this rebirth with you, this new beginning with you. This could have been said because maybe you can't get pregnant because... It, it was some things that was said. It may be something said concerning you not being able to have kids. The Empress. You may not be able to have kids because it's over the Two of Swords. And then the Empress came out. But this person is still in love with you. They still love you. Six of Pentacles is here. They know they can have an equal give and take with you. They'll give the world. You're the world to this person. They could have offered to give this person, the world, money. To... Yep, King of Pentacles. They offered to give this person money. That's crazy. Holy Spirit, Aquarius. That's for somebody. This is it. Stability. But they felt like maybe this they felt like they was being fed illusions that they was gonna get breadcrumb or it wasn't enough or something's king of king of pentacles. Maybe it wouldn't have made them stable. Or they know they can have an equal give and take with you. They respect you. Maybe they have a lot of respect for you. They love you. King, Nine of Cups, they love you. This person, they love you. They respect you. They, you're nurturing, you're kind to this person. Like, they really respect you. They're, oh, they walked away from that offer, honey. King of Swords is here. Because they want a victory with you. This person stands on truth. And what's right. This other air sign. They stand on what's right on truth. They could have told this person the truth that they love you. 
They told this parent the truth that they love you. A mother could have said something that you can't have kids, you never have a family with this person because they can't have kids. Something of that nature. I mean, it was an explosion. It, whatever was said probably blew this person's top. It made them angry. But they stood their ground and they defended you. Okay, Aquarius, whoever this is for. Oh my God, it's not my feeling. All right, Aquarius, this is your reading. Like, share, hit the notification button to be notified when I post a video. Um, I hope I can help somebody out there. Um, well, you with somebody that truly loves you, that's in love with you, that stood their ground for you, stood up for you. Yep. Wow. Okay, so um, I'm out. Okay, I'm out. Um, I love you guys. Stay tuned for some more readings. Okay? Be good. Aquarius. I hope I can help. I'm out. Love y'all. Like, share, hit the notification button to be notified when I post videos.